better from Dublin. My name is Nika. Today I'm going to be showing you a house in Malahide Road. And the first thing that you need to know about Malahide Road is that it's located about 10 to 15 minutes by bus from Dublin city centre, more or less, and about 5 to 10 minutes by car. So you got walking distance from the house, you got several things. You got, first of all, the bus stop is just right outside. You just need to walk out the door and you have the bus stop. And um, right across the street, you have a park. Then down the road, you have shops and pubs, restaurants, banks, everything that you need just walking distance. So you are very well located. Um, I think that's about it. And now come with me and I'll show you around. Very well. So this is the front door. This is the entrance hall. Those are the steps which I'll be showing you in a few moments, because first I'm going to show you downstairs. So as soon as you come in, when you turn to your right, you have the first bedroom, which is bedroom number one. So in this bedroom, you have two single beds, You have the wardrobe, which is nice and spacious, as you can see. There is a nightstand over here. The heater is right next to the beds. There is also a desk, as you can see, and the view leads to the front of the house. All right, so that is it for bedroom number two. And now let's continue. So right across, from this bedroom, you have the living room. And in the living room, you have a nice, big, comfy sofa. And you have a TV and an armchair. So it's very nice and comfy. So over here, you have some storage space. We have the downstairs toilet. And now you have the kitchen and the other downstairs bedrooms. So over here is bedroom number two. And this bedroom has a single bed, a nice, big, spacious wardrobe, there's also a desk, the heater is right by the window, and you also have shelves. The window leads to the back yard, to the back garden. And that is it for bedroom number two. Right across from it is bedroom number three, which is closed at this moment. And here you have part of the kitchen. So you have kitchen counters have a microwave and the kitchen so the kitchen is very bright and spacious you have one fridge over here and another one over here so you got two in total got microwave and kitchen appliances, like the kettle, 
you have the oven and the stove. There's the cupboard. We have plates and things that you need. There is the back garden, the backyard. And the door that leads to the back garden. All right, so that is it for the ground floor. And now let's go up the steps to see the rest of the bedrooms. Very well, so we come up the steps. And this is the hall in the first floor. And now let's see the rest of the bedrooms. So first here to your right, you have bedroom number four. And in this bedroom, you have a single bed. You also have a desk and a wardrobe. Got the wardrobe right here. You got the heating right next to the window. And the window leads to the front of the house. Very well. Now right next to it is the bathroom. And you have your toilet, sink, and shower. And you also have a heating unit inside the bathroom, which is always a good idea, especially when it gets cold. Okay. So now bedroom number five. So bedroom number five has two single beds, two large wardrobes, and one desk. So the wardrobes are very spacious, as you can see. So you got loads of storage space. You get the heater right here next to one of the beds. And the window leads to the back of the house. Leads to the garden. Okay, so that is it for bedroom number five. And now, right next to it is bedroom number six. This bedroom also has two single beds and two desks, a nice big wardrobe, a chest of drawers, and some shelves. Okay, the heating is right here behind one of the desks. And here is the second desk in case you didn't see it. The window leads to the front of the house. And that is it for bedroom number six. So last but not least, we have bedroom number seven. And bedroom number seven has one single bed, 
you have the heater it's right here next to the bed you've got a desk and a nice big wardrobe the window leads to the front of the house and that is it so that is all for now thank you very much for watching if you have any further questions or queries just send us an email and we'll get right back to you and i'll see you next time bye